Hey guys, it's Nicole and welcome back to my channel. Today I'll be doing a what's in my bag video. So this is the very first what's in my bag video that I'm ever doing. And to be honest, sometimes I do carry different types of things depending on where I'm going and stuff like that. But today's video will be focusing on what I carry when I go out during the weekends, whether it's to a nice meal, a nice date, or even just to see my friends. So today's bag that I'll be featuring is this gorgeous bag over here. It's the MS Birkin 25 in a very very nice orange color. So this is a pasta from my mom and I absolutely love it. I think the bag is just really gorgeous and I love the color as well. I like how it just like pops out and it's just very fun. I try to take very very good care of it whenever I use it. I also really like to use smaller type of bags. I hardly use big bags unless I'm going to work or going for a staycation or like a long trip or something like that. So yeah, let's get started. So the first thing that I always have in my bag is definitely my phone as well as my work phone. I usually try to carry my work phone wherever I go because I'm the type of person that likes to check my emails whenever they come in even though I might be answering them later on. I just like to be assured and to know like what's coming in because I don't want any surprises. I know some people might find that a little bit unhealthy but it's just my personal way of dealing with work. The next thing I have in my bag, which is probably the second most important thing that I need whenever I go out is my wallet. So I actually got this wallet a few years ago for my birthday and I think it's super super nice. I really like the black lambskin and even though some people may say that it's quite big for a wallet and it takes up a considerable amount of space in my bag, I generally prefer bigger wallets because I just have a lot of cards and a lot of like miscellaneous receipts that I like to keep just in case. So I think a bigger wallet is probably more suitable for me. So the next thing that I have have in my bag is this pouch, a multi-purpose pouch where I basically keep a lot of other things inside. So let's open this together. The first thing in my pouch is this box of Eclipse Mints. So every time I go out, I must have a box of mints with me. I'm the type of person that loves to snack a lot and I feel like whenever I snack on mints, I generally don't get that hungry and it helps me not overeat. I know it's pretty weird but that's just a personal thing that I do. And sometimes when I go out for a meal, you know there's that after like meal taste. So I like to cleanse my mouth with mints as well. So this is a must have for me every single time I go out. The next thing in my pouch is actually this scrunchie. So this scrunchie was also given by my mom. So it's something very precious. To me. Recently it's been very hot or Singapore's weather has always been very hot but I find myself sweating a lot these days maybe because my hair is getting very long. So yeah I mean it's just a great option to tie my hair in case I ever want to. So the next thing in my pouch is actually this lip gloss which is my all-time ever favorite lip gloss from Chanel. I generally like my lip makeup to be a bit more shiny, glossy rather than matte or like velvety and I think this really does the job. It's also really great to carry this around whenever I go out because every time I have a meal, like my lip color just disappears. So this is really good for touch-ups and photo taking as well. So the next thing in my bag is this empty small pouch. So I always like to carry this mini pouch with me just in case I have to take off my jewelry and put it somewhere. And the reason is because sometimes you never know, it can be raining or maybe ad hoc. I want to go and do some sport activity so I have to take out my stuff and put it in my bag. There was an instance where I didn't have like a mini pouch to put my stuff and it did have a little bit of scratches so ever since then I always make sure to carry a little mini pouch with me. So the next thing I have in my bag is my sunscreen. So I actually have very very sensitive skin and quite bad pigmentation so ever since I've been to the dermatologist they always tell me that I have to wear sunscreen when whenever I go out. I've recently started using this particular brand called Sigi Skin and I really like it because it's like cruelty free and it also smoothens out very nicely. I've used sunscreens in the past whereby whenever I apply it, I look like a ghost because it's just so like white but this one surprisingly fits my skin tone quite well so yeah. The next thing I have in my bag is actually both a perfume as well as a hand sanitizer. So this is super useful because it's basically two benefits in one. Um, it acts as a perfume as well as a hand sanitizer. It also smells 
really nice. It's like a citrus floral scent, which is really great because as I've mentioned before, Singapore is super hot and I kind of sweat a lot. So it's great to freshen up with this. So that's it guys for today's video. I hope that you've enjoyed my first ever what's in my bag video. If you like this video, please do give it a like as well as subscribe and I'll see you guys very soon. Bye-bye!